form Arias, I think it's not the result she expected. No, definitely not. So it's a bit colder now. Not perfect for the sprinters. And look, Gonzalez will take the first of the boxes on the inside. Best idea in wet conditions, I'm not sure. There's not much room on the inside there, so it might hit the curb, but. Off they are, and that's Ecuador in front. Ecuador is Maria Arias, followed by Ivan Noches. Gonzalez with a little gap. And they're racing for fifth, sixth, and seventh position. And Gonzalez is not going full speed as the first one did. And that's Maria Arias. Fifth place, Ivan Notches. Sixth place, and we see Luisa Gonzalez with the seventh place. And now we are ready. A final. World final of the one last sprint. Representing Guatemala, Ellen Rivera Sorto. And multiple European champion and the world of medalist representing France, Matilde Pedro. Yeah, Guatemala looked really good in the semi-finals in the win, so that uh, would be really nice to see a smaller nation like Guatemala take a win. Yes, Helen Rivero Soto. Also French, Matilde Petrono. Extremely strong in the semis. From Colombia, Moffy Timps. And also Colombia, Melissa Reboledo. Could never count out the Colombians, so this is really anyone's game. Two Colombians in the final. One of the harder thing yes. to race. Yes. Important and we know Tim uh, is a is a really fast starter. Yeah. So four front starts, and we see <laughs> in front Colombia. Colombia, France, Guatemala, now Colombia on the inside. France had a really strong last corner in her semis, so maybe she can... Whoa, whoa. It's Colombia, Colombia and France. In the last corner, straight hawk finish, photo finish, and it's Tim's. Colombia, Colombia. Unofficially, Robert Ribaledo. Pedro no third. It's the first world title for Melissa! Melissa! Melissa Reboledo! And the track speaker announces Reboledo, new world champion, and the one lap. Look at this last meters in the replay. Okay, good to see. Reboledo yeah. was hard to see for us. And the speaker's booty. So it's Reboledo. 